Yo, what is going on, guys? Finally made it over here from TikTok. You know, it's my first YouTube video. This is uh, going to be a crypto TikTok, crypto YouTube video. So, I mean, just going into it, the first things that I'm looking at, we're going to look at the Bitcoin levels, and then we're going to see what's happening. So, I mean, looking at, I just have a 30-minute chart pulled up right now. We are, like, actually holding up here above 20,000. That is a good thing. It's good and bad for the most part. It's good. The longer we hold up above 20,000, that is a bullish indicator. Because as soon as it gets down in these levels, let me maybe pull up another chart. As soon as it breaks down under 20,000 again, that's going to open up another, just another huge bearish scenario. And then if we have any more, uh, any more news articles like let's say 3ac celsius any more things like that that will bring us farther down but as far as this goes like we're looking good like i can even pull up another chart let's just pull up a five minute you know it's it is holding these levels daily even on the daily it's holding up on these levels and i mean the daily is scary like this shit is scary to look at but I mean, we, we're here in the trenches. Like, there's nothing we can do. So, one of the other things, the next altcoin rotation. What is a altcoin rotation, if you don't know what that is? An altcoin rotation is when Bitcoin starts taking off. So, let's say Bitcoin does a move up here to 30,000. That means that all of these altcoins, altcoins are just smaller market caps. So, even... Even like Ethereum is called like an altcoin, but even though it's so big. So once we get this altcoin rotation, hypothetically, Bitcoin goes up to 30,000, we're going to see some of these lower market cap coins go ape shit. Now, like some of the ones I'm looking at, I love Phantom Network. Let me try to pull up Phantom. Like, I, I love Phantom. This is one of the ones that will do it 100%. Like this is one you can see it right now. Like it's already going up more on the upside than Bitcoin is, you know, because it's a lot smaller. And so this is a governance coin. So smaller coins on the Phantom Network, they're going to go up even higher than that. So for example, the one I'm in, the one I'm teamed with, you know, Soul Swap. Shout out Soul Swap. Above 1 0. Like, this could go on a huge rotation. They're saying right here, we're at 1 0 right now. Top 1 4. If Bitcoin goes up to 30,000, this would go up like 5x. You know, just based on those numbers. And that's easy money at 500k market cap. Like, without a doubt. How am I going to profit from the next altcoin rotation? Phantom is my bread and butter for making money and getting out of. Like, I know people will do, um, you know, AVAX, uh, Tron, Binance Smart Chain. I've, I've been in Binance Smart Chain. I do respect it. But because of the low gas fees, that's why I'm mainly in Phantom right now. So these altcoins, I can go in and get out, like, quick, no problem. And low gas, you know, like, like the Ethereum shit, I'm not even going to talk about it. But that is how we are going to profit. Jerome Powell holds all the keys. Jerome Powell and these interest rates, that's a big, a big factor. So, what was it, two weeks ago? Jerome Powell raised them up 75 BPS, which is 0.75% for interest rates. Like, that's, it's big, it's almost 1%, you know? That's almost 1%. That made everything fake pump and then it crashed like it should have but then there's another thing that came into play not even a week after and that's the pension rebalancing that i have right here the pension rebalancing did this where should i pull it up well let's do trading view let me pull up the spy this is what happened yesterday we get a pump like this, right? 
because of pinch and rebalancing. There's a lot of pensions, like, you know, one of the biggest pensions that I know is the California Teachers Pension. You know, that may have been one of the ones in this, you know, just like SPY, uh, all these different pensions there. They all have to do rebalancing, so they have to sell off some of the assets they have, or it's also uh, bonds that are maturing at this date. So the last week, like from June 20th to July 1st, there is new money that has to be injected into the market. Like it has to be, and that is one of like the biggest bullish factors right now. That's why I almost like want to say it's a fake pump because of what's going on with SPY. Like that that's just what I have to call it. I have to call for what it is. I mean, if you guys agree with me, like let me know down in the comments. Like, do you think it's a fake pump, or do you think that like the bull market is back on? Because this is why I am just on guard. The the pension rebalancing, like, it is a big deal because it is, like, billions and billions of dollars flowing in. And as soon as it stops flowing in, you know, next week, we're going to be wondering what's going to happen next. I am, at least. If it is still bullish, like, if we stay bullish, then you can expect the rotation. You can expect some of these rotations easily. Like, it's... It's in dire need. Like, it's it's about time, guys. I mean, like, it is what it is. Like, this shit is going to come back up, and everyone, all the futters are going to be proved wrong. And and those people who follow me on Twitter, you're definitely going to make it. You follow me on TikTok, you're definitely going to make it. And, um, yeah, peace out, guys. Like and subscribe for the next one.